Hi, I'm Jim Juback, and welcome to this week's Trend of the Week video. Trend is Christmas. Bah humbug! Not me, but Harris recently did a poll for Bloomberg that said 60% of the people polled say they're going to buy fewer gifts for fewer people this Christmas. Inflation is the problem. 60% um, say they're cutting back on holiday travel. 33% uh, have decided to skip gift giving completely. Okay, uh, we won't talk about what this means for the meaning of Christmas or the soul of Americans or anything like that. We will talk about what this is likely to do to retail earnings and airline earnings. These are stocks that, that are very sensitive to month-to-month -month shifts in consumer behavior. So the question is, when we start to get uh, reports in January from companies like Walmart, Costco, Kohl's, uh, what are they going to say about Christmas sales? They've already been trying to let Wall Street know and investors know that sales are likely to be not great for Christmas. But the question is whether they're going to be sufficiently prepared and whether there'll still be a surprise. Uh, the likelihood is the surprise, despite the preparation, will be fairly significant. I mean, Costco on December 10th uh, announced its earnings for the fiscal first quarter of 2023. Uh, and it saw uh, comparable store sales go up by 6%. Wall Street was expecting 6.9%. Uh, and consequently, we got this really horrendous looking chart. <laughs> Here's the drop. And this, this happened even though the company had told Wall Street that it was seeing problems, even though Wall Street had uh, been notified that margins were going to be soft, uh, gross margins were down about 45 basis points for the quarter uh, on inflation and the inability to pass through all the costs. So this is Costco, which is a really great retailer uh, and has a great mix of goods, low prices, a lot of gasoline sales, so a lot of traffic. Uh, Costco and Walmart are probably the best uh, brick and mortar retailers, best position for this period. So if that's the problem that Costco is having, uh, look at problems for other companies like Kohl's, KSS, uh, and the whole retail section. And then, of course, there's the question of whether um, the drop in, in holiday travel is going to be enough to put uh, a little knock on the airline stocks, which have been going up very heavily uh, on higher prices and higher traffic and uh, a drop in fuel costs. So look for all those things in January. And until then, uh, drink, your, drink your, your wassail and your eggnog, and we'll try to forget about January, okay? Even though it's my birthday month. I'll talk to you later. This is Jim Drewback. If you like this video, please... Uh, give us a thumbs up. Uh, you should subscribe to my YouTube channel. That way you get notification when we're doing all of them. Um, we're doing about three a week. If you want more of my stuff, um, you can go to my free site. That's jubeckpicks.com. Uh, uh, if you want even more, six portfolios instead of three with some ETFs and some options and some inverse um, plays on, on this bear market, you go to my paid site. That's jubeckam.com. You'll find links to all that down below. Thanks for watching.